This episode was brought to you by QI Boy 3C Store. NGO fans, long time no see. Just so you all know, we've done this wonderful video which we prepared just before the lockdown began. And this is about preempting COVID and whether or not people should go on dates or stay at home and use poor hop. Hope you enjoy. Hi, it's NGO here. We're here in Trafalgar Square and I'm here with Say It and Roland. And Roland. <laughs> his name is very memorable. <laughs> Thought about, you know, whether or not you know, the coronavirus is affecting you and how it's affecting Tinder life and how's your Tinder life going? So, do you want to start first before you see? No, no, I'm not, uh, I'm not doing much with Tinder, that's the fun part. <laughs> but in Midlands, if you look at the people there, everyone is in lockdown. We're not doing anything, so what are you going to do if you're having a Tinder date? Yeah, no, it makes sense. You're going to go make the most out of it, you know? Everyone's got to be inside, but to be inside with someone that you want to be with. For first date? People doing it? I don't know. Hey, are you doing it? You're just a good first date. It's a good point. Like, first dates, you usually go to like a restaurant or something or go to the movies. Yeah, movies is locked down. We can't go to restaurants. Um, Basically, the sh like the shopping mall is the only thing you do. We yeah. have to go shopping for, like, at the supermarket as a date. Right. That is insane. <laughs> That's That's insane. Man. I don't know. know. I just saw a tweet about Netflix party. So <laughs> you can you can join a link and you can if you're both on Netflix you can watch the same movie at the same time. That's cute. Oh, That's so cute. there's a quarantine date watching Netflix <laughs> without you. <laughs> oh. Do you think now the apps will actually be used even more? Because me and my um, cameraman here we had a bet and he was saying that th at this time now. Pornhub is going to make a lot of money. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god that's such yeah. a good point. I didn't even think Mate, of that. Porn is going to go through the fucking roof. People You're are going to be sat at home jerking off 24 fucking seven. They're like, oh, where is my lotion? No more. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's why the tissues are done back <laughs> now. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I never considered porn, but the porn industry is going to be making Firing fucking up. Yeah. That's it. That time I'm investing in it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I can see it now, written in the headlines. Porn hub. Yeah. Golden lights. <laughs> Glowing. <laughs> My millions. There it is. <laughs> porn hub is going to yeah. fire up then. And are you a user of anything like Tinder? Uh, depends on how lonely I am. It yeah, depends on how lonely <laughs> you are. That's a legit answer. So, That's cool, yeah, man. sometimes cool. I'm on it, sometimes I'm not. So, as a respectable man, you know, who's occasionally on Tinder, you know? Occasionally. Occasionally, you know? Are you expected to use it a bit more frequently now that you know that we've left people out here? Uh, well, I'm with my friend here, yeah, so I'm oh, fine with oh, Tinder right now. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so. Yeah. so, you know, did you meet her from Tinder as well? <laughs> <laughs> No. No, 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 no. I, I, I did not. Oh, you haven't seen that No, no, I didn't meet her on Tinder. See, see, see. Yeah, I met her in real life. Ah, uh, see, see, see. Yeah. The IOL, yeah, I get that. That's cool. I'm sure you've been scouting around for talent. Bruh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> clearly not. Clearly. <laughs> I'm so finished. No, I'm not. I mean, I'm alright, yeah. So. For you two, you know, how you find the dating life now that you know everyone's in quarantine? I mean, we're together, so it's good. <laughs> <laughs> so, so it's going so well, for it. us, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. For us, it's fine. Well, we're going to work out maybe tomorrow, I might move into his. A little yeah, premature. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's <laughs> premature. Is it premature? It's never We're on the cards. Really <laughs> well, there, there you go. <laughs> And the yeah. good thing is, you know, at least you have great company, you know, when you're getting locked down, you know. Exactly. The best person to be with. Exactly. Yeah, yeah you agree with that? Yeah. I agree with that, yeah. Shall we see you in, in two months' time? Yeah. <laughs> now that everyone's, you know, in quarantine, do you think your mates will be using more the Tinder apps, or do you think they'll be going on more to porn? I, I know my mates will be going more to porn. <laughs> <laughs> Shot by the I think mine might just either be celibate or go down and get some, um, Batteries and yeah. Because like everyone's gonna be like a bit quarantined, there'll be a lot of like we could be at more like dating sites and on as you said, pull up. I just oh, I guess that's what they're bored. Good choice. What do you not think? Do you think we'll be more active on that? Um not necessarily, but I thought about that, like, I have a boyfriend at home. <laughs> but if I was stuck here for X amount of times, I probably would be, like, you know, 
I mean, we're all human. <laughs> I feel like the same thing with her, but for me, it's like porn is something sparingly. Like, I don't indulge in it. Yeah. Oh, cool. Period. So I this is not going to do anything anymore, like, make me want to be in it more. Oh, I see what's out there, but I don't do shit. Yeah. I want to meet someone person to person. Okay, am I live? Okay, me. Joining in or is he joining? Uh, is, no. is he part of the show? No, no, no. One, one man band, yes. one girl band. Yes. yes. Okay. I personally don't like this trend of online dating. Why? Uh, because. Uh, let me explain you my experience. Okay. I was in a soulmate relationship, right? I had this strong feeling and he acknowledged my feelings too, that okay, we are soulmates. But you know what happened? One day after one year of exclusive dating, I came to know that he was active on uh, different dating sites because Ooh. he was just so addictive of the attention. Yeah? Yes. Yes, exactly. Thank you for adding that. <laughs> Mr. Player Polygamous. <laughs> and he was like, oh, I just get attention. Like, can you believe that? Because it's very easy. You just scroll, you get it. So I'm against online dating. If you're exclusive to someone, please do not date online. Shut down your accounts. Be exclusive to the person. Like, yeah, to me, it was a bad experience. No, dating sites, big no for me. Also, so me and my mate here, we had a little bit earlier. Oh, yeah, yeah. And basically, I was betting that people were using Tinder more, but he was saying this is a time for Pornhub. So we were taking bets on thinking whether or not people will be using more Tinder yeah, yeah, or yeah. Pornhub yeah. during this time. Yeah. Honestly, I'm not a fan of either, to be honest. Porn, it can be a bit, like, dangerous, you know, like, I don't know if you're like, no fap and stuff like that. I study Tantra, so I don't know if you're about Tantra. So Tantra is like sexual energy. It's like sexual yoga. Okay. The thing with Tantra is guys who study Tantra don't ejaculate. Right. Sexual energy to yourself. Like that. It's a secret of your power. <laughs> Yeah, so when you study Tantra, like, porn just becomes irrelevant, like, because it's not important anymore. So you use other things to, like, stimulate your sexual chakras and things. So my view on Tinder is, like, if a guy can't walk up to a girl yeah. and chat her up, yeah. he's not a fucking man. Do you know what I mean? To my girls. L London, London, did you hear that? <laughs> yeah. How many girls are in this street right now? Like, they're everywhere, right? That's if true. you can't walk up to a girl and say, like, I, you know, I like you, mm -hmm. like, What's up with you, you know what I mean? Okay. So yeah, that's my advice that's cool. to you guys. You can't walk up to a woman and say what you want. You're never gonna be able to have a relationship. And um, yeah, we've been going around asking a few people about what they've, how they've been experiencing the coronavirus in London with the quarantine and what they're expecting from their dating life. I feel like in terms of coronavirus, I feel like people are just a bit more cautious yeah. because even though you might feel like you're healthy and well, you can't like, be sure that the person you're seeing or dating is. Basically that, like, you know, the person you're dating, you just don't trust them. To an extent. <laughs> but it's like, even if even if I do trust them, it's like, do I trust the people that they're living with? Like, shared accommodations, things like that. So you like, I don't trust no one in the household? I don't know. I don't know. If I hear a cough, I'm leaving. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> you're so basically, you're saying that your dating experience so far has been quite nice, that, you know, you're experiencing some dates, but everyone's at arm's length. Not necessarily. I'm, I'm willing to take the risks, innit? Oh, okay. But <laughs> I need reassurance before need reassurance. I do. If I'm... So do, do you need to look into your eyes and be like, I'm, I'm cured? Not, not necessarily. Just like, do you have any symptoms? Are you taking any precautions? Like, when you're travelling, for example, to work, are you, like, wearing a mask? Are you yeah, sanitising, washing your yeah, hands? Like, like, dust the mask. Exactly. You, and do they do this? Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, I know, innit? Yeah. That's mad. <laughs> yeah. How would you say you were going to do on your dating life now that, you know, the coronavirus has happened? Well, everybody's thinking about it. Yeah. Like, especially, like, I am thinking about hygiene. Whenever I'm, like, in the subway or, like, in the, in the underground, yeah. I can think, like, ah, I don't want to touch that button because, mm, now because yeah. of with the virus. You've seen the people walking around with little plastic gloves lately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is also quite ridiculous because you you don't want to have it on your hands because you'll touch your face. With a fucking glove, you'll still touch your face. Exactly. So it's dumb, but <laughs> whatever. Um, I lost the question. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Um, yeah, people will think about it a, li a bit more. Think about hygiene in in, in general, I guess. Seriously. Which is a good thing. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I agree with that. Oh, dating life. Oh. Are you, what are you not doing on it? Are you not using any sort of apps or anything? Uh, using Hinge. Okay. But yeah. yeah. But, I yeah. Not, yeah, yeah, not no, really. Are, are people tasteless there? Yeah. No, no flavor. Like you seem a bit. Yeah, no. Yeah, I'll go 
open it, look, browse, yeah. browse the web. <laughs> Found it though. Yeah. Well, clearly nothing sticking in there for you right no, now. No, not not right now. Mm. We'll give it time. We'll give it time. Give it time, you know. Yeah. You know time. After the battle, so then everyone's out, you know. Yeah, they're like maybe not today. <laughs> Give me a month and a half, and maybe more. <laughs> <laughs> but to be honest, like Tinder has not died down at all. Let me just say, like if you're, if you're on Tinder, you're on Tinder. Like nobody's quieting down their like profile you're at like, all. What is and Instagram? Instagram's just as bad as Tinder, and everyone's just as active. I'm not from London. I'm from the countryside, and they are making more of a fuss on it than anyone in London. Mm. Everyone, yeah. everyone's making more of a fuss. Like yeah. everyone's fucking gone on lockdown. But here, everyone's like, who gives a fuck? Honestly, if I'm yeah. gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. Yeah. No. Yeah. 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 I'm a painting on Hinge or Tinder, whatever, like, I'm gonna you know, take the risk. You, you gotta shoot your shot, you know? Exactly. exactly! The only thing I'm worried about is just passing it on to people. I get is, it. That, is this your confession that you've actually got it right now? Uh, yeah, maybe. Like, 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 maybe. Maybe. Let me get the. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, not even. Not yeah. even. Other people will be out here scouting for talent, or do you think they'll be more using that Tinder? Than yeah, I think that everybody is mostly inside, only a few brave people are outside, so definitely Tinder is gonna be on the app, Bon Hub as well. Hey, um, hey, he said that, you know, earlier. Now that, you know, with your opinion on it, and everyone's now going into quarantine, mm -hmm. do you think it'll be used more or less? And if less, what do you think it'll be used more? I'm not sure about that, but. You know what, even I think, if if dating website would be active in the age of Romeo and Juliet, Romeo would be effing around with those websites. You know, Juliet would be like, Romeo, where are you? Why are you not giving me attention? Because Romeo is bloody online. Yeah, she, so. she, she would have taken that pill and like he would never have done his one after. Yes. Like, oh no, um, babes, I was um, out, you know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> babes, I was scrolling and liking other girls yeah, while like, you were waiting for me. <laughs> yes, give me my mask back. Okay, fine, I'm going for operation. <laughs> 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 thank you guys, thank cool. you so much. You guys are doing so well. So, have you been finding you know this whole coronavirus thing and how do you think it's going to affect your Tinder well, Tinder or regular dating life? If things happen to me, it will happen today, tomorrow, day after, so it will happen. So it's all what I need to do is just taking care of myself, taking care of the people around me, yeah. and the rest. Live, That's man. the most important thing. Cool. Got it. Are oh, you sensible yeah, genius? Look at this guy, yeah, look at this yeah, guy! Yeah. Yes! <laughs> so, you know, now we know, it's like Jimmy the hustle, you know, Jimmy the man with the sanitizer. Oh, <laughs> Spread the love.